Hi class, this is Mrs. Kaur. I'm here to help you guys with the assessment task part A, which is the puzzle. I know a few of you have done it, but a few of you are struggling to solve the puzzle and assemble it. So I've got an exemplar for you guys to help you to know how we are going to solve it and then put it, in a, it on a piece of paper so that it comes out as a shape. Right? So this is one of the exemplar. It looks similar to what you have in your assessment task, but it is not the same. The questions are different. So the first step is we need to cut out each and every shape out. So once we cut all the shapes out, they should look like this. Again, reminding you, this is just an exemplar. For you guys, there should be some squares and some triangles coming out. So now what we are going to do is to start solving the questions one by one and putting the question and the answer side by side. So now I'm going to solve out some of the questions with you so that we know how to put the questions and answers together. Let's say I'm going to pick out this out, this one. So it's, it says coefficient of y into y plus 3. Now there are discrepancies between the inks because my printer ran out of ink and I have to write a few things up. So let's put this up in and now I'm going to find out the answer. We know what the coefficient is. It's the number in front of the y. So I'm going to find out a shape which has a number in front of y which is 2. So I'm looking at where the 2 is. Oh here I get the 2. So you see the answer 2 here. I'm going to put this just on the side of just next to the questions just like that say so, that's the question that's the solution to the question right now I'm going to look at the other question acute angle is what than 90 degrees is it more is it less yesterday we studied in the class that acute angle is less so I'm going to look at the options all the triangles where is less I can see less here so I'll pick that triangle up and put it on the right spot just like that so you see the question is there the answer came came next to it now we have another question simplify 2xy plus 6xy minus 2 now we know that these two are the like terms they can be added because this is a plus sign in it so probably we are going to get 2 plus 6 8xy and then a minus 2 Let's find out where our answer is. Here it is. So 8xy minus 2. I'm going to put this answer just next to where the question is. And so on. So you can see that uh, something is turning up. Even if it is not coming up this way, you just have to try and get into it, uh, it into a nice shape. Now you see there is another question. Write the expression of sum of 3 and 2x. So a sum of 3 and 2x. So what are we going to do? Take 3 plus 2x. So you see the answer is here on this shape. I'll pick it up, put it next to it. Just like that. Now, what next are we going to do? There is no question left and our shape is complete. However, now we have two answers. We need to find out what questions comes to comes next to it. So 180. I'm going through the things which can go there. So see here. So the question says reflex angle is more than dash degrees. 180 degrees. So this shape will probably fit over here. Right? And then furthermore i've got two answers i need to find the questions um so so x is equals to 2 is probably the answer to some equation just over there so solve the equation that's the answer to this one and then we have x and y is equals to what are what terms so they are unlike terms so i'm going to pick this up put it over there and the last thing is seven i have just this piece left it says three plus four is equals to seven so it just goes there so you can see that my puzzle has given me a triangle shape your puzzle is going to give you another shape not a triangle but maybe a square or an oval or 
a rectangle i don't know you need to solve it out to find out what shape do you get once you're happy with your shape take a glue stick and stick it on and that's the answer to your puzzle thank you